Hello, Pokemon fans! Professor K here. And what's that? For the Pokemon Evolutionaries, and today we're going to be having another matchup video. Uh, it's going to be Primal Fish versus Primal Lizard. Yes, Roar. I just made that up. <laughs> heads or tails? Tails. And it's heads, so I'll go first. And surprisingly, you probably can't guess who's running what. Well, you can if you see the sleeves anyways. Yeah. But uh, I'm actually choosing to run the Primal Fish. Yeah, as much as I love Primal Fish, the problem with Groudon's always been kind of like an underdog thing amongst players, so I gotta go with the underdog. Yep, that's always your style to go rogue and anti-meta and all that good stuff. So, we're gonna have this little matchup here for you guys. See which one of these two legendary Pokemon are gonna come out on top in this TCG matchup. Alrighty, here we go. So, I'm gonna start off with a Kyrim versus two Groudon EX. Okay, we're gonna draw a turn, bench a Kyogre, play a Dive Ball. Yes. The larval form of primal fish. <laughs> if he wasn't, uh, if he was a bug, yeah, definitely. It's just a larva. Yeah. He's the whale larva of primal fish. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna play that down. Going to attach to Kyogre, and then gonna switch. That and pass. Attach a. Come on. Okay. There we go. Strong energy. And unfortunately, I got a pass. All right. Draw a turn. Way and hit. Thank you. Yeah. I had it in my hand last turn, but I was going to use a letter, but I think I'd rather conserve my letters from when I have a uh, Primal Kyogre in play since I can attach two per turn with this Alpha Growth ability. Ancient trait. I keep saying ability, it's an ancient trait. Yep. It's going to take some getting used to since it's a new mechanic in the TCG. Still isn't technically legal yet, is it? I mean, what is today? The 26th? Actually, it is legal. <laughs> Never mind. It's legal as of February 25th, to be exact. 21 days after street release date. Yep, so at our reading, the Primal Flush will be legal. It should be very interesting, to say the least. All right, so I'm going to attach. It's going to be a fuster cluck. <laughs> that's, that's a nice way of putting it. All right, so I'm going to use Water Pulse for 30 damage and put your active Pokemon to sleep. And keep it asleep. OK. No skin off mummies. All right, just gonna play arena. Let's get out the spirit link. And why not? Ground the X. Okay. Bench that. Attach the spirit link. Primal Revive, Reversion, because that's the correct term in this particular case, even though it says Mega. Primal, and you mega. not read Mega. Primal. Yes, but it says Mega. It also says Primal. It's Mega, Primal Ground. In the video game, this does not count as Mega <laughs> Evolution. So, hey, I'm just saying what the card says. I'm not disputing anything else. And I pass. Still asleep. Bench. Um, boy, I have the almost perfect hand too. So I'm gonna have to burst seeker for N. I have two water energies and a primal Kyogre in my hand. Just no spirit link. No spirit link. Bullet, chorus, and teammates. 
kind of bad thing for me is I can't do anything to that Primal Groudon now as far as playing any trainer cards against it with his Omega Barrier. Yep, especially Lysander, so Primal Groudon comes out when Primal Groudon is good and ready. And there's nothing you can do about it. Ultra Ball for my Victini EX, which is my energy acceleration, and play Chorus. Switch and victory piece. Way to spoil it. <laughs> it's not that hard to figure out. Oh, not quite. Attach for turn, and I will pass. Okay, still asleep. Four in a row. Wow. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna use that coin anymore. Okay, your spirit link, and dive ball, or primal. And Primal Fish! Quick shuffle up. Okay, you can cut. And Juniper. Now even though those sleeves aren't exactly good quality, I really like the design it picked this time. Yeah, they did a lot better with the, uh, that's for sure. Yeah, I haven't been as impressed with the sleeves since the Mega Lucario ones. Yep. So we're going to attach two energies due to Primal Kyogre's Alpha Growth Ancient Trait, allowing me to attach one extra energy to him per turn. Um, and then I will use Tidal Storm for 150 damage and 30 to all benched EX Pokemon. Allie. Take, nope. Yeah, that's the ground here. So yeah. Take two prizes. That's correct. Go for a turn. Attach a fighting energy. Shell play arena. This is where Victini works really well with this deck because it's energy acceleration and you can Karina for an ace spec that applies only to Victini X and that's Victory Piece. Victory Piece allows you to attack with Victini all of the attacks for free. No energy required. Yeah, because a lot of old Victini EX decks didn't run this and I cannot understand why. Uh, tool, uh, tool Scrapper back then was a thing, obviously. Megaphone still is, but not as many people play Megaphones anymore. Oh, I'm not even sure why I shuffled, because I'm going to use Turbo Energize. Bingo! All right. And now, just like that, I have a fully powered up Groudon. More Primal Groudon. All right. Now I attach my two energies to Primal Kyogre. Cut. And I will use Tidal Storm for 300 damage on Victini EX for knockout. Slight overkill, but just a little bit. It's all good. And of course, 30 to everybody on the bench. All right, let's get Primal Groudon out. Alrighty, not quite what I wanted, but hmm, do I want to attach that there? Yeah, I do. All right, another thing I play in this deck, Pokemon Center Lady. Ouch! Because it's your opponent's trainers that can't be affected. Your trainers can still do whatever. Yeah. And even though there's no stadium in play, I shall use Gaia Volcano for 140 damage. 140. Okay, 120. Uh, if I had a stadium, that would still be a knockout right now. It would be. You're absolutely right. And what's crazy, I run six stadiums in this deck. Yeah, your ends actually got rid of them. Did they really? Yeah, because <laughs> I actually was getting stadiums, but I was afraid of you countering them with store stadiums. <laughs> Which, wait a minute. I haven't played any stadiums either. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, neither one of us have seen stadiums, which is crazy, because we both play multiple copies of stadiums. Yeah. Um, hmm. And wait, wait, what I said just made no sense, because even if you countered my steam, it still helps me. Yeah, it still, it doesn't matter, no matter what. Uh, I guess I just didn't want to counter a fighting stadium. Yeah. Which now it doesn't matter with those two in play, but... Yeah, and with Omega Barrier, even if you did run them, no enhanced hammers, no hammers at all. Yep, very true, very true. Alright. And then that. Alright, I'll go ahead and attach them. Go ahead and use Tidal Storm for 150 and 30 to the bench. And play this over here. Alright. Draw for turn. 
attach. We have seeker for a Corina. Okay, and play it. We have switch and rhino ground. Okay. Primal Reversion and I play the switch. Because once again it's my trainer and I can do that. And Guy Volcano for 120, leaving you with knockout. Yep. Alright. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to have to bring up this guy over. <coughs> That's 240. Oops. That's gonna be a knockout. You're so lucky. You know why? Why? Fighting at strong energy in my fighting stadium. Do you know what's crazy though? What? That computer search, I top decked it. I completely top decked it. it well, otherwise, I wouldn't be able to do anything. Mm -hmm. But I got the top deck computer search, so. Title Storm for 150 damage, knockout, 30 on the Primal, doesn't matter, two prizes, and dang, that's it. It looks like Primal Kyogre overwhelms Primal Groudon, which is surprising, because you would think once you set up a Groudon, it's just going to run through everything, but I guess you just really need those stadiums. Yep. So, and I got that for my prizes. Uh, I wonder how many, what else was in there? Another big team. Like, no, just one. Okay. And I remember that, that should leave five in here. It should, yeah, this deck runs five stadium Six, cards. actually. Six? Oh yeah. my goodness, wow. That is ridiculous. But like I said, one more turn. One more turn and I would have been doomed. So luckily I top decked the computer search, otherwise he would have had that game easily. Once you set up a Primal Ground on, it just runs through everything. It, you can get everything yeah. into play. So, so I lost this time, there's no help in it. Hey, that is what it is. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. As you can see, Primal Fish defeats the Primal Lizard. And uh, be sure to like this video if you liked it. Comment down below if you have anything you'd like to say. And of course, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Uh, plenty of more TCG content in the future. And uh, we're going to be going to regionals, obviously, tomorrow. So we may not have any videos up uh, for the next few days, but uh, we're going to try to do our best. So, wish us luck. We'll see you guys next time. I'm Professor K. And I'm Ed. We're the Pokemon Evolutionaries. Grrr. Yeah.